Hey guys, my name is William. In today's video, we're going to talk about how to steal your competitor's backlinks. That's right, how to steal your competitor's backlinks. So in today's video, we're going to talk about how to steal your competition or competitor's backlinks. It's one of the few and far between things most people don't look at. Normally, when we're doing an SEO audit, if you will, we'll come in here and we'll go through here and I'll tell you all the issues that you're having with your website. But like in this case, this website's decent. It's not, you know, nothing too crazy or anything like that. Uh, the client sent it to me for review. But sometimes what you got to do is you got to look at the back end. The back end is where a lot of people don't see the successes at. Most people look at the front end and they're like, well, I do the same thing as they do, maybe even a better job. But then what happens is they go, <clears throat> they say, so I, in my mind, should be outranking this person. But the fact is, the back end or what you see below the water is usually why someone's being successful. It could be why someone's making more money than you. It could be why someone's getting more jobs than you, more leads than you, et cetera. What are they doing? What offers, et cetera. All types of different things. In SEO, it would be, if you will, their processes, backlinks, etc. So in this case, let's say, for example, this is the website. We know it's Home Remodeling Miami. So let's find her number one competition, if you will. Home Remodeling, Modeling Miami. <coughs> Miami Kitchen and Bath Remodeling LLC. I'm going to tell you something funny. This company right here actually, believe it or not, is an old company I used to do SEO for a long, long time ago. I'd say probably at least a good five years ago. I'm the one that set up this company website etc so i know very well who they are so your number one competition right here is actually a company that i had originally set up um key factor we look at normally they have miami kitchen remodeling in their name they have all that so we want to look at various things but for example if we were to take uh let's just take this website and this website and i usually take the top three so i take all three of these websites if you will and i want to go to <clears throat> and i want to go to and pull their websites so i'm gonna pull their websites that's the first thing i'm going to do and then i'm going to show you what most people don't do what should be doing <clears throat> I also have this other little tool, which I've been featuring. I use it all the time. You know, it is called Home Remod. It's your, if you will, your backlink or SEO spyglass. I use it. It's from All in One Power Suite. I use it because I can white label my reports. I'm not an affiliate of it. But so, for example, I can look at your backlinks. I see you got 474 backlinks coming from 355 domains. If I look at most of your domains, they're all, you know, <clears throat> the end link is garbage. In other words, they're not good. The other thing I'm looking at is none of them are niche relevant links. <clears throat> niche relevant meaning they need to be in the home remodeling niche and none of them are. Some of them, many of them, <clears throat> if you will, excuse me, are from other countries. They're not even, a lot of them aren't even from the States. So what we want to do, <coughs> excuse me, is we want to go in and we want to take all of your competitors' backlinks, right? Every one of these guys, this is the number one dude. And we want to find out, first off, okay, where are they Add as far as backlinks we take that sheet and we're going to download all of their backlinks 
for all three of these guys, that's step one. We're going to find their backlinks, step one. Step one is find their backlinks, right? Step two is to combine the list. Combine the list of backlinks. And then finally, step three is outreach to get the same backlinks, right? And this handy dandy little report as well, what's very good about it is it tells me they got 628 backlinks. This is from my old client. And on here, you can then qualify and say, okay, what page is it mainly going to? Okay, I can look at is it do follow or no follow, all right? I can look at the anchor text, what type of anchor text they have, and I take all this information and I download it as an Excel file, okay? I'm going to do that for all three competitors. That's the first one. He had 600 and something, almost 650. Then we go over to the next one. Right, and we're gonna do the same thing. The same thing, all right? This is where you're looking at the back end to see what do they have that you don't have. And then you go and get what they have that you don't have, right? The website looks great, their website looks great, but you're lacking in backlinks, so what do we do? We go and put a list together of all their backlinks and then we go to those same companies that they're backlinking on and get them. And we use the same hypertext. We use the same anchor text and everything. Create the same pages they're going to. If they're going to a page that you don't have, you want to create that page. Right? This one's got 447. So you can see if I start combining all these, let's say I combine the top five or so, I'm going to come out with, let's say, a couple of thousand backlinks that I'm going to have to go to. I look at their anchor text, what type of anchor text they're having, what pages they're going to, right? How many do follow backlinks do they have? All this information is very important. I can even look at the, if you will, referral traffic if I had it here. I can look at penalty risk if there is any <clears throat> on any of these backlinks, etc. And this helps me. Okay, so in today's video, what I wanted to show you was how we can take your competition and look at all of their backlinks and then go out and we do outreach. So we've downloaded these backlinks now into an Excel file. Next step is we're going to go out and we're going to email <coughs> these people to get the backlinks. If you would like my SOP on this process, please comment below and I will get that over to you. Once again, my name is William, and in today's video, we covered how to find and steal your competition's backlinks. I hope that you found this informative. I hope it helps you out. If it did, please give this video a like. Make sure to subscribe and comment below. I appreciate you guys. You guys be blessed. Have a great day. So many SEOs that hate me and say that I'm still in their methods. They bitching and cry, labeling me SEO Black Hatter was a nobody. Now I'm at the top, most wanted, most loved, bad business owners, and hated by most SEO opponents. You think you're an SEO god, but you're an SEO fraud. Guess I'm the SEO devil, shout fuck the SEO guys. White hat SEO doesn't make sense, going with the goody goodies.